there's a worldwide pandemic that's going on and we're all basically locked into our houses i've been locked in for like a month now i've barely even gone out for some essentials so since all of us are basically locked down and we're enjoying our time in home a lot of us are actually missing the outdoors i am a big fan of going out and doing stuff being around people and just enjoying my time in the outside world but since we're all locked down, I just wanted to go back in memory and visit my India trip, um, specifically the best parts of my India trip. This is my third vlog and here I'm just going to be you know, showing you guys how I went through the best times in my India trip and I just want to kind of go over the fun and the amazing parts of my India trip. And um, most of it is going to be Gurdwara and uh, visiting where you can see there are a lot more people and a lot more to do with social life. So on January 15th, it was Maggi and it's a big celebration in Punjab. So we were headed out to Sultanpur Lodi. Um, the Gurdwara we're going to go in this video is going to be um, Gurdwara Beir Sahib. That's the main Gurdwara. And as you can see, it was packed with a lot of people. Hello. So for some family emergencies, we had to leave the Gurdwara Beir Sahib pretty early and then we were headed on towards Jalandhar to meet some family. On January 17th, two days later, we're now headed to the Darbar Sahib Amritsar and this was probably the best top day of my trip as it highlights basically the best time I've had and that's one thing that I always look forward to when I go to India and just being there, being serene with, you know, the amazing vibes at Darbar Sahib Amritsar is just completely next level and this trip we actually um, enjoyed a lot of food as well um, a lot of Amritsari kolche and all that kind of stuff so this trip really just stands out and I was watching this video and all those moments where you know you see that delicious food being made and being served to you and that's the kind of times when you're just like missing all that and um, you just kind of wish that things would get better around the world. So the first place we visited after um, arriving in Amritsar was Gurdwar Babek Sar Sahib. Um, so we did spend a little bit of time there and then we're headed on towards the Bar Sahib.
So once we got inside, um, obviously we were stunned with all the views and everything as every single time. It's the, I think it's the most relaxing view I've ever seen till the day once you enter the Barca, you're just, you know, kind of in awe of how peaceful and blissful the whole entire place is. And I think that's kind of the beauty of the Barca, that it's not just, you know, a pretty place. It's kind of just an amazing experience on the inside as well. Once we got inside, uh, we obviously went to do Ishnan. Uh, it was quite cold that day and <laughs> taking taking a bath in the Sarovar was not an easy task as I just like, I went down into the water and I'm basically bouncing back out because I was literally just losing my mind of how cold the Sarovar was and it was just, it was just cold. And um, so once that was over, um, literally nothing felt cold. Um, even wearing a sweater was like, giving me sweats because nothing felt cold anymore. So we did a quick little prakarma, I took a lot of photos and we sat um, inside the Darbar Sub uh, for a little bit and then we were headed out um, for some more food. Um, this time around we went to Paramadar Taba which is about, uh, I would say like a half a mile away. We didn't know what else to order except Amritsari Kolche and at this point we were thinking like, you know, we're kind of eating the same thing over and over again but it was just quite the experience in food so we had to go for Amritsari Kolche again. Um, we, we would say that the first time um, next to Darbar Sahib, uh, Kuan Singh Kolche and was much better but this was a more fancier dining experience so it kind of makes up for the price and it being not as good. So and then we came back to Darbar Sahib, I took a lot more night shots of Darbar Sahib and um, that basically concluded our trip. Um, after Rara Sahib we basically left Darbar Sahib and we're headed on to the way home and it was quite a foggy night but we made it home safely in about 3 hours back to Sharpur.
If you guys like this video, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.